Okay, welcome back here to Fading Hearts. I'm here as usual with the incredible, the wonderful, the fantastic me. <laughs> also here is Laura and April. Say hello, guys. <laughs> hello, guys. <laughs> hello. <laughs> And they are incredible, wonderful, and fantastic as well. In fact, to be totally honest with you guys, incredible, -er -er, wonderful, -er -er, and more fantastic, -er -er, <laughs> you are less likely to find. <laughs> so, <laughs> in the last episode, we uh, did some work on the database. We got snubbed by Sophia. And the and, and, mm. and we got indoctrinated into the cult of the anime. That's right. Mm. So... Good times. Yeah, oh, great, yeah. So Friday, we're going to go somewhere else. Any preference, guys? Um... Well, maybe the girls hang out in Hannah's. Maybe that's their spot. Because we've yeah, not okay. seen them for a while. Let's give it a try. I think, we, I think we've got over our allergic reaction to bubble tea anyway. So. Laura just really, really, really wants to do the bubble tea. <laughs> and it's cheaper to read here. <laughs> it's cheaper to read here. Right. Um, yeah, I guess just read. Let's read. Let's read. And we got we got $132 now. Ooh. Yeah, so, all right. Advanced programming. I start reading the book about programming. Blah. <laughs> I've learned some advanced programming techniques. You've learned programming one. Uh, and we're seriously pissed. <laughs> Reading in the atmosphere of the bubble tea shop is fun. My mind starts to drift away. Of course it does. I really must learn to chain it down. <laughs> Sis, you're tired, aren't you? My little brother asks, tugging at my hand. No, I should, somebody else should have read that. Somebody else read that. Somebody else read that. In fact, do both of them. <laughs> what? No, oh, no, that <laughs> should... That, oh, yeah. No. Somebody do, somebody do right. the little brother. Sis, you're tired, aren't you? My little brother asks, <laughs> tugging at my hand. <laughs> April. Oh, okay. <laughs> oh, man. No, no, I'm fine, really. <laughs> I protest, but he doesn't let go. Don't be like that, sis. You have to rest too, or you won't do good. <laughs> it's it's like Rena, but with a deep, gravelly accent. <laughs> Seizing both of my hands this time, he starts to pull me once again. If you say so. Sadly. Suddenly, I'm too tired to argue and allow myself to be guided to the couch. The soft cushions are a blissfully welcome respite for my weary body. Dinner is almost ready. Hey. He informs. Oh, sorry. Hey. He informs me and raises his voice. Hey. I am Laura, skipper of lines. <laughs> hey. Dinner is almost ready. Could one of you put out the fire? You, fire, get out. I'll do it. I'll do it. One of my little sisters calls out and races inside. She holds up a wand, and with a quick flourish, water appears from nowhere to douse the fire. Unfortunately, it was an oil fire, so she just sets fire to the house. <laughs> Steam rises from the ashes, but a another wave of her wand forces it up through the chimney. You shouldn't really do that with ashes. Well, it's about time. My other little sister declares so as she wand? enters. Is this, yes. is this one of them? No, it's the Weasleys. <laughs> <laughs> my, my, my brother glares at her sternly. What, Jim Bob? Oh, right. I'll I'll go wash up while you finish. Right. Good night, John Boy. <laughs> Good night, Muriel. <laughs> Good night, Mama. Good night, Papa. <laughs> Good night, Grandpa. <laughs> Uh, me too, me too, announces her second cousin twice removed, <laughs> and they both scamper upstairs together. Sis, you work so hard all the time, so I'm working hard too. He smiles up at me proudly, then waves a hand towards the dinner table. You go ahead and sit down, and I'll bring out the meal. <laughs> he sounds about three, and anybody's eaten something cooked by somebody who's about three? <laughs> no. <laughs> I smile back and follow him, where he pulls out the chair at the head of the table for me. 
I sink into it gratefully. I'll bring everything out. You just wait here. With these words, he disappears into the kitchen and returns with several dishes of food. He's becoming so skilled at cooking and serving. That's you, April. Oh, I think. You made turkey and rice today, as well as a dessert. <laughs> Busy guy. Sorry, did we wake you? Uh, I'm so terribly sorry. <laughs> At least I can only assume that whatever's under the, the covered dish is a surprise dessert. The table is already set as well, which is suspiciously uncommon occurrence because it's normally a bit wobbly at this point. <laughs> All right, you can bring it out now. My little brother yells upstairs. Wait, it. Happy birthday. <laughs> <laughs> no, sing that. <laughs> oh, Happy yeah. birthday, Mr. President. Yes. Oh, sorry. Uh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> All right. <laughs> the girls emerge from a hallway with a dainty golden tiara. Oh dear, a dainty <gasps> golden tiara weird. held carefully in her hands. Oh, oh my God. Laura. <laughs> <laughs> to celebrate your graduate. Oh, I mean you need to do this in unison. We all need to do it myself. actually. Yeah. Okay, three, two, one. To celebrate, to celebrate your, graduation your graduation from, from the, the Intermediate, intermediate League. League. <laughs> <laughs> mm -hmm. London's burning, <laughs> London's burning. Uh, all three, three children speak in unison. We hear I crown, crown you princess for a day. day. <laughs> <laughs> it's like we're all singing to different tunes. <laughs> <laughs> the girls bend on one knee and present the tiara to I me. I should have been a sister. What, Laura? <laughs> <laughs> what? That's so funny. <laughs> I want the tiara. <laughs> you want the tiara? <laughs> you come near me, I'll cut you. I'm wearing. <laughs> this is my tiara, bitch. You can't have it. <laughs> yeah, you're awfully fond of your eyeballs, aren't you? <laughs> <laughs> I think that's your line, April. All of you. That was so worth doing, wasn't it? Yep. My eyes are blurry with sudden tears, and a lump in my throat keeps me from speaking. Apart from those words, and perhaps some more. <laughs> the girls solemnly place the tiara on my head and bow before me. Your Highness! But... How do you... I'm so overcome that I can <laughs> scarcely keep my eyes open. I can scarcely get the words out to ask how they could have possibly known what this means to Basically, me. Yeah. <laughs> or dream, what is gonna, what Laura is going to do to me to get that tiara back. Because you always read about princesses. My little brother is grinning so broadly. I know it had to be, have been his idea. And you already are princess. Aww. My youngest sister informs That's me. So cute. You're strong and kind and pretty. That's adorable. And can I borrow some money? <laughs> I touch the tiara on my head gingerly. It's a real golden tiara. How they managed such a thing and kept it a secret? I have no idea. Come my are you three? <laughs> I open my wide, uh, my arms wide, and they... Just having a stroke. <laughs> <laughs> they hurtle themselves to me with a heartfelt embrace. Unfortunately, it just aggravates the concussion I got earlier. You've done so much for us, sis. We wanted to do something for you, too. The older of my two sisters oh, tells sorry. me, impersonating the brother. <laughs> Spot on. Her voice muffled by my shirt. We want to make you happy, because they make us happy. My other sister smiles up at me. <laughs> Feeling the warmth of their arms around me, the tears flow freely from my eyes. Though we may not have been bound by blood, the four of us are bound by something even stronger. There was only four of them? What the hell? Yeah. <laughs> really didn't seem like it. And one day we will find the keys to those padlocks. <laughs> We're a family now. In order to provide for them, I will train and train and train until I win every tournament. We, we love, love you, sis. sis. 
<laughs> April's fully in character now. We love you, sis. I don't want to do this. Uh, <laughs> my head hurts. Morcus. I want to do this. I just wanted my character to, uh, you know, sound like Liz Lemon. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Uh, <laughs> uh, let's, let's... Right, we haven't had any new books turn up yet, so let's go outside. Let's go to Tachibana Park. <laughs> and let's go and see what the forest gives us this time. Since it's night time, the woods are undoubtedly crawling with predators. Go punch them in the face. <laughs> yeah, not to mention the shadowy kind. You don't get what they mean by that. <laughs> well, we predators. The, no, as not. well as the shadow predators. No. Um, men wearing yeah. large clo coats yeah. and nothing else. Yeah, and that's the part that I'm like, yeah. yeah. I mean, yeah, yeah. I mean, that, okay, the, the, the trick here, okay, is that he's realised it because he's, he's noticed he has to walk past a whole street full of vans to get to the park. Hmm. <laughs> I still don't know why there are all these strange shadow creatures around here, but if I don't investigate, I'll never find out. On the bright side, if I don't investigate, I'll never find out. Let's explore. I walk around the forest for a while. Blair, I don't see anything except trees and grass. Oh, that was exciting. Okay. Mm. I go to bed and fall asleep. Oh, your purse. Normally, I do it the other way around. <laughs> I've received a package. Provisional Princess, Volume 1. Bookmark light. Uh, check back shelf, books, books in bag. Provisional Princess, Volume 1. You're going to have to read that. <laughs> My backpack is full. Good lord. Oh, it's Saturday. We don't go to school. No, it's, it's a day I'll get off. Give me a chance. <laughs> <laughs> okay, alright. Um, should we go outside? Or is there anything you'd like to do here? Yeah, oh, I'll tell you what. Let's read Provisional Princess, shall we? I start reading Provisional Princess, Volume 1. The story is about the kind-hearted Celia, who is the princess of a magical country. But in that land, the reigning queen is always the woman with the most magical power. Whether or not Celia will actually succeed, in her, uh, succeed her mother remains to be seen. Hence the manga's title. The castle staff adore Celia and spoil her outrageously, but she resents this because she wants to become strong enough to ascend to the throne someday. She decides to secretly undergo harsh training and convinces one of her mother's advisors to help her. Her first lesson is the magic blast spell. Ooh, we just learned a spell. Hmm, I think we might have actually, yeah. In which case, that was well worth doing. Uh, okay, I, what would you guys like to do? I want to see the ghettos, but I don't know how you do it. Uh, we've got to call them. I suppose we could go outside and hope that we run into one of them. Hmm. Okay. okay, let's do that. Um, presumably the bubble team shot? Sure. Oh, yeah. And we'll relax. Relaxing, we're relaxing. I feel better now after resting for a bit. No story, yay. <laughs> there you go, call someone. We can call Rena. Let's call Rena. Uh, I dial Rena's number. Ring, ring. Hello, Ryu. Hey, Rena. Do you want to hang out sometime? I'd love to. Hey, I tell you what. Let's go somewhere and buy you an extra dress. <laughs> Why don't we go to the park and figure out a plan to help Claire? Yes, we can set one of those scorpions on our boyfriend. <laughs> Why don't we go Your to line. the park and figure out a plan to... Oh, let's... <laughs> <laughs> let's she's, meet up. She's... I was putting some down. Let's I'm meet just... up tomorrow. <laughs> she's rubber banding. I just love the fact that she, she blames Sam. <laughs> yeah. S Sam, the kitten, the one who can't <laughs> defend himself. <laughs> <laughs> like he's, he's just constantly one up here and he's punning the mad. You're just taking advantage of the fact that your pet can't talk. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. It's wrong, I tell you, wrong. 
Why don't we have an option to water that philodendron? I, don't know. I decided to take a rest. <laughs> I feel better now after resting for a bit. Then I go to sleep. <laughs> I'm sorry if this party picks up. <laughs> no, I don't hear it. <laughs> I, go to, I go to bed and fall asleep. Lulled by the sound of purring <laughs> comes over the ether for some strange reason. I receive a package, The Prince's Tale, Volume 1. Okay, unread mail. Here are some tips. 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 Tip. Now, let's move on to the next point. Tip. This is the email of love. <laughs> a young woman is always looking for new experiences. Sometimes she feels trapped like a bird in a cage. Wind on her haunches. She knows the cage is there to protect her, but she still yearns to break free. Also, working out does you a little bit of an advantage, the player. Okay, uh, <laughs> listening to this, I couldn't help but thinking of something. Only, only, I think only people that Brit watch British television would get this, but it's, it's just the line which goes through my head: "Making love to a beautiful woman is like making love to a beautiful woman." <laughs> what? <laughs> <laughs> I think I'll leave people to Google that one. It'll take too long. <laughs> it's like the other okay, day so... when you called me a grasshopper. I was like, what? <laughs> then I looked it up and I was like, oh, okay, thanks. <laughs> yeah. And now everyone else will have to look it up. I'm not my fault I'm old. I remember TV from the 70s. Oh, I knew what that meant. Mm. Laura and I are the oh, same yeah. age. <laughs> mm. I mean, in fact, I don't actually remember any TV after the 90s, to be honest with you. Mm. But... After the 90s. Okay. Let's let's read a prince's tale. Read a book. Read a book. A print. Oh yeah, yeah. These do get used up. Look at this. There we go. I start. I start reading the prince's tale, volume one. The story is about a prince named Gabriel, the only child of Queen Luana, and her husband, Prince Arlen. Since she has no daughters, Gabriel's wife will one day become queen regnant of the country. The girls who seek Prince Gabriel's hand in marriage will compete in magical tournaments, hoping to impress him with their immense power. Yes, power, that's the word. Those who are in high enough rank in the arena are sometimes invited to royal dinner and balls, so Prince Gabriel has the chance to converse with them, and they have a chance to see the royal balls. <laughs> he doesn't understand their feelings. <laughs> <laughs> but he still enjoys seeing their sincere smiles. Somehow I can empathize with that. I'm four years old. <laughs> ah, yes, four years old. Now there's a goal to aim for. <laughs> I arrive at the park early, but this time Rena turned up even earlier. Paging Laura. Oh, that's you. Paging Laura. That's you. Oh, yes, so it is. Hey, <laughs> Brina. Hey, look, come on, it's one o'clock in the morning. Give me a break. <laughs> Hi, where are you? There, yeah, I'm awake now. Great. She waves cheerfully and all but runs over me. Ru sorry, all but runs over to me. All right. Let's stop that monster from ever hurting Claire again. Yeah, let's go into the woods and get one of those scorpions. <laughs> Of course, there's no way we'll let him take advantage of her. Rena is sure fired up about this. I expected her to be scared and worried, but instead, she's full of resolve. And terribly pissed. Her determination lifts my spirits. Maybe we approach her together and tell her not to see him anymore. She'll listen to us. Oh yes, that's really going to work. Yeah. Claire is so stubborn that I doubt she'll listen if we just tell her to stop seeing him. But we have to make them break up somehow. Maybe we don't. Huh? What do you mean? I think that if we can find them, and if they, if we can hire them, maybe we can hire the A-Team. <laughs> <laughs> I think maybe we're going about this the wrong way. Claire made a decision to state this guy, right? If we try to tell her what to do, she'll just get more defensive and stubborn about it. That's just how she is. Oh, this is reverse Percycology, isn't it? You're right, but what can we do? I want to talk to her more, but I've been so busy lately. Oh, do you have a part-time job? Huh? What do you mean? Making it's a job that you do part-time. <laughs> 
I heard you quit all your clubs at school. Do you have a part-time job or something? Oh, you, you heard about that, huh? You're right. I do have a part-time job now. It's pretty demanding, though. I'm really tired all the time. What sort of job? Oh, um, well... Hi, class hooker. <laughs> I guess I can tell you. It's... Da 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 da. Porn! Modeling! Anyone else want to want to shout out for Rena Does Dallas? <laughs> Whoa. Oh, but Ryan, you have to promise not to tell, okay? You will, right? Right? Yeah, photos or it didn't happen. She, she just doesn't I smile on. reassuringly. She doesn't want to be called Shallow Throat. <laughs> <laughs> Don't worry, your secret is safe with me. Thanks. That means a lot to me. You're so cute. I bet they pay you a ton. <laughs> That's how it's paid. <laughs> <laughs> if you want someone to rehearse with, just let me know. Too bad the photographs can't capture the beauty inside your heart. Photoshop totally can. Yes. <laughs> <Hopefully not. laughs> Sorry. <laughs> you, you just finish your conversation. Don't worry about us. You know, yeah. he's, he's, he's having a. He's, uh, no, never mind. Oh, Ryan, don't say things like that. You should be thinking about Claire right now, but I'm glad you think so. Thanks. Rena smiles warmly at me. It's electrifying. It's electrifying, <laughs> yeah. You better shape up. Because I'm getting mad. And I had to sell you. And I had to sell you. There's another copyright strike on this video. <laughs> we chat a bit more, but we never come up with a surefire way to make Claire dump her boyfriend. And I think that's where we stop. <laughs> okay. <laughs> and inadvertently, and please bear in mind, I said it before it showed up. We we we're gonna stop on a cliffhanger. Oh. But that's just the way we roll here. Yeah. That is that. Ooh. <laughs> <coughs> right. I'd like to you guys. I'd like to thank you guys for coming along. It's been it's been real fun this evening. <laughs> <laughs> it did have. Yeah. Thanks very much. Thanks for having. And if you guys are watching this and appreciated it, please give us a like. If you haven't subscribed, please subscribe and go along and look at these guys' channels. They've got hundreds upon hundreds of Sims, Sims. dating Sims, <laughs> more <Some> Sims. Sims. <laughs> yeah, occasionally a bit of Sims as well. But to be fair, really, that's my really channel. April stuff. has a lot more variety on hers. <laughs> yes. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> There's Dark Souls and Sims. Alice. <laughs> Alice, yes, yeah. that's true. And some of this, this stuff of a game called World of Warcraft, Thank which you know, I've heard of, but I've never played. <laughs> uh, nah. You have your liar. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Yes, Minecraft, you two, get on my server, finish your buildings. <laughs> yeah, I know. <laughs> <laughs> uh, so, okay, until the next time. Yep. Thank you, and good night. Bye.